many were the hazards faced by competitors in the grueling East African Safari Rally. Under the worst conditions yet experienced in this trial of car and driver, 88 entrants set off from Nairobi. Ahead of them were 3,000 miles of the world's toughest road test. Waterlogged roads, often no more than cattle tracks, were one of the worst hazards drivers had to contend with. Tough suspension is essential, but a Citroen copes with the problem. A Saab, well known for their success in European rallies, is followed by a comparative newcomer to the scene, a Japanese-entered Toyota. A Ford Cortina of Smith and McConnell, which finished eighth. A Peugeot 404. First Cortina to arrive back at Nairobi, driven by Vic Preston and Bob Gerrish. Still heading for home, the Japanese Datsun. The majority of entrants didn't make it. Out of 88 starters, only nine completed the course. But Ford's won the manufacturer's prize. With 79 cars falling out along the way, it was indeed a great victory for Bob Shankland and Chris Rothwell. Driving a Peugeot 404, they did extremely well to cross the finishing line one hour ahead of their nearest rival.